Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, by IIT Encoder. We have so far looked at various things we are dealing with, but we will be looking at the most important concept in this video. You may guess what it is from the title itself, it is network variables. So if you are, if you have used unit before, it is basically sync wires, which has been changed to network variables and there isn't much information on how to use them actually so i will tell you how to use that i will also tell you what are the bugs that i faced in working with them and how you can overcome them so without wasting time let's move forward let's open the script manager so in the manager we will be implementing this network variable uh so you can test it by building i won't show you how it works i will show you like i can't give you a demo because i will have to present two screens but i will show you the code which is working i have tested it and you can easily test it one more thing if you are using project loaner and you are trying to like host your game and run the client on the same laptop in two editors then sometimes your network variables won't sync and might not connect with ml api and you may have issues so the best thing to test is build the game run two instances and test it because that's the foolproof way of testing and if it still doesn't work then it's your issue but if it doesn't work in the editor then it doesn't mean that it is not working it is possible that it works and you need to test it in the build so okay so manager how do we actually use mlapi.network variable we write using mlapi dot that's a start next let us declare a network variable so public network variable bool let's say test equals okay bool test equals new network variable bool and if you want to initialize it you can initialize it with false or maybe true like whatever you want true now if you want to like update it or set any value before that you need to set yeah the settings of the network variable here so we will just set the setting so we will write test dot settings dot Test dot settings dot write permission equals network variable permission dot you can set it either only server can change it or only client can change it or everyone can change it and similarly you can one thing to note here is it is mandatory to put the permissions because sometimes without the permission the code just fails and it, you think that it is running it sometimes works but it sometimes fails so it is better to initialize the permissions in the void start otherwise it will take some default permissions and ml api is still in development so things happen now you need to use the value right so if his host okay one more thing i haven't yet started the host here but uh this is just for doing like just for showing you so you must have started the host when you are using the network variables of course otherwise who will they sync with so if is host we can use test dot value equals true 
if you don't write test dot value then it won't take the value it would give you an error because test is a network variable and it has a value of dot value it's just and we are setting it to true and if we are is client if you are a client then what we do is test dot value we can use it directly so just let's just debug dot log it so debug dot log test dot value and in this way we can actually use it and as we have written network variable permissions dot everyone we can actually set it test dot value equals false and here we can write debug dot log test dot value server plus this and client plus this so change this to true and change this to false so now when you run this code and you connect two devices the host will always give a true value for the network variable and the client will give the false value for because whenever it goes into this loop it changes the test dot value to false and when it ever goes to its client it changes to the true now one thing to note here is the network variables always have a small lag so don't expect them to be instantaneous and you should take care of that in your code so it was great making this video the network variable was a very small concept so i covered it very fast we you can change this to here to float and float and 0f you can change this to int you can change this to int and so on basically these are the major types so thank you for watching this video hope you liked it please do like share and subscribe and if you have any doubt any leave them in the comment section and video show read the comment section for suggestions for the next video thank you very much